2020 has given us a bunch of longtime romance breakups we were not prepared for. Like Lily Reinhardt and Cole Sprouse's Riverdale relationship on screen went off screen and stayed a thing for three years. That is until May when Bughead IRL broke our hearts and bit the dust. Kristen Cavallari and Jay Cutler revealed plans to end their decade-long coupledom, telling fans on social media, with great sadness, after 10 years together, we've come to a loving conclusion to get a divorce. Adding, this is just the situation of two people growing apart. Megan Fox and Brian Austin Green's roller coaster romance seems to have come to a complete halt. After years of marriage, followed by one divorce filing, then a reconciliation, and then another kid together. But the fact that Megan now appears to be cuddling up to Machine Gun Kelly is further proof she and Brian Austin Green are donezo. A source recently told E! News they are hooking up and have been for a little while. Well, okay then. Speaking of sexy rapper rebounds, Cara Delevingne and Ashley Benson ended their two-year relationship in early April. Soon after, Ashley was spotted with Halsey's ex, g Easy. But an insider tells E! News right now the two aren't dating, but are definitely hanging out and having fun. Mary-Kate Olsen recently filed for divorce from hubby Olivier Sarkozy after five years of marriage, but was denied. That's because New York's Office of Court Administration had a moratorium on all criminal and civil court proceedings, not deemed essential. But this was lifted and Mary-Kate and her legal team were able to file. Beauty influencer Jeffree Star was also with his man for five years, but he confirmed his January breakup in a YouTube video. There's no easy way to say this, but we did break up. Vanessa Hudgens and Austin Butler seem to be in it for the long haul, which is why we were shocked when their nine-year love story came to an end. Their split may not last forever, though. It's a matter of distance. They're just shooting on two different continents, a source told E! News. There is no bad blood at all, and they have a lot of respect for each other. Another insider added, though Hudgens and Butler are split for now, they're going to see what happens. Same goes for Scott Disick and Sophia Ritchie. Though the couple just went their separate ways after three years of dating, a source tells E! News it's very likely they will reconcile in the near future.